you're going to look a lot like your dad. See that, Catherine? Oh, oh, very strapping. <laughs> it's a big world out there, son, full of all sorts of people. What about you? What kind of person are you going to be? J You're James? just a... Catherine? James! Catherine! She's in cardiac are... arrest. Start compressions. James. Get the baby out of here. Move! Move! One, one thousand. Two, one thousand. Come on. Hang on, Catherine. Hang on. Okay. You... We need a doctor, not a dead man. Fail to meet my expectations no. and there will be no. James and his cheery charity. Don't look straight into the light, pal. You'll hurt just your like eyes. Her. It's just something you get used to down here. Come on over here, son. Come on. Walk to Daddy. Daddy. There you go. My goodness. Just a year old and already walking like a pro. Your mother would have been so proud. Listen, kiddo, I know you don't like it when Daddy leaves you alone, but I need you to take care of yourself for a minute. You just stay here while Daddy runs to his office. You'll be okay, pal. I'll be back in a bit.
are quite the little explorer, aren't you? Serves me right for trying to pin you in. Come on over here. I want to show you something. Favorite passage. It's from the Bible. Revelation 21.6. I am Alpha and Omega. The beginning and the end. I will give unto him that is a thirst of the fountain of the water of life freely. She always loved that. All right, come on. Let's go see if your little friend Amada wants to play. on too fast. You blinded the poor kid. Happy, Happy birthday. birthday! Happy birthday! Can you believe it? He is growing up so fast. Happy birthday, pal. I can't believe you're already ten. I'm so proud of you. If only your Congratulations, mother... Congratulations, young man. I don't have to tell you how special this day is, do I? Down here in Vault 101, when you turn ten, well... You're ready to take on your first official vault responsibilities. So here you are. As overseer, I hereby present to you your very own Pip-Boy 3000. Get used to it. You'll be getting your first work assignment tomorrow. <laughs> Enjoy your party. You're only ten once, so have fun. Happy birthday! We really surprised you, didn't we? <laughs> Your dad was afraid you were on to us. But I told him not to worry. You're so easy to fool. Shut up. And it isn't my fault that Butch and Wally are here. Your dad said we had to invite them. Never mind them. Time for your present. What do you think I got you? Go on, try to guess. Ha! I knew I'd surprise you. Who's your favorite barbarian? That's right, Grognak. Issue 14. And with no missing pages. I found this in a box of my father's old things. Believe it or not, imagine him reading comic books. I guess everybody was ten once. Well, I better let you get back to mingling with your guests. We'll talk later, okay? Happy birthday. Oh man, you got a pit boy. I wish I was ten. Hey, uh, thanks for inviting me. Really cool party and everything. I know that, uh, Butch and I give you a hard time, but you don't take that seriously, right? Anyway, uh, happy birthday and everything. I better get back to, you know. Happy birthday! What, are you two best friends now? Hey, Wally, I think Paul's gone soft on us. Happy birthday, Sonny. Introduce our new best friend. Who do you mean, dork face here? Happy birthday, dork face. <laughs> happy birthday! Attention, everyone! Time to cut the cake! How's it going, pal? Junk. I think you have to wind it up every morning. Nonsense. People... This party's pretty good, I guess. For a little kid. Balloons, party hats. Not as cool as my party, though. Remember how my dad got Andy to do magic tricks? And we all played Hunt the Mutant in the atrium? Oh, right. You weren't invited to my party. Too bad, man. It was really fun. Always enjoy my little so, speech. What do you think we should call Besides, our game? That friend it's of yours could totally use a reminder now. that life is not all hey, how about fun and games. Dwellers? Get it? Nice. Who wants to uh, go around all day being called be a vault Are you having a nice party? Ten years old. My, my, my. 
Seems like only yesterday that your daddy came. Goodness, listen to me ramble. You're waiting for your present, aren't you? Such a nice, polite young man you are. Don't ever lose your gift to speaking your mind so directly. We could use more of that down here. Here you go. A nice sweet roll that I baked for you just this morning. And it's all for you. You're the birthday boy. No sharing required today. You know, sometimes I think you really are as You should try it sometime, Daddy. I'm hungry, and that stupid robot destroyed the cake. Give me that sweet roll you got from old lady Palmer. Talk about my mom, you little punk. You might like it. You're gonna be sorry, you little... Do you think we surprised him? Butch, what do you think you're doing? Leave him alone. Suspected a thing. Come on, Molly. You always have good you're ideas. Right, What's Butch's problem, anyway? I can't believe he tried to start a fight at your own birthday party. What a jerk. God, he really is a butthead. Oh well, you can always count on Butch to make an ass of himself. Get it? <laughs> he didn't hurt yeah. you, did he? Thanks for coming, Stanley. I know you were busy with the water purifier. Jeez, Everything's fine, I... Are you alright? Is Butch giving you a hard time again? I'm glad to hear it. Once you start letting bullies push you around, you'll never see the end of it. Come on now. I bet there's someone else out there with a present for you. Oh, sure. Nothing to worry about. Me and Andy got her all fixed up again last night. Good as new. I am worried. mortified about the cake right? this happened. How do you like that, Pip-Boy, son? Fit all right and everything? As a matter of fact, I did. I'm glad you like it. Some may think the A-Series is a bit basic, but I've always preferred them for their reliability. Don't mention it. Oh, yes, I almost forgot. Happy birthday! Not much, but I hope you like it. Simply mortified. How are you enjoying... Party, Mrs. Palmer. I help with the decorations, you know. Oh, having fun? Enjoying yourself? Um, what about the tunnel rats? Where Happy birth! I hope you appreciate the effort Amara put into this party. She really seems to like you, for some reason. Don't presume too much on her friendship, young man. I'm still the overseer, and I'm still in charge of this vault and everyone in it. Tough enough? Uh, sure. I mean, I really like that one. Hello, Officer Gomez. Well, I'm glad you could I don't know. I've got to think about Jonas? it. I'm glad to be here. I think it's important uh, hey, to keep in touch with all set down here. Were our oh rats God. tough Thanks. enough? Thanks. I'll send them right down. Hey, that was Jonas on the intercom. He and I have been cooking up a little surprise present. Jonas is waiting for you downstairs on the reactor level. Go ahead. I don't think anyone will mind if you slip out for a few minutes. No. Maybe. Uh, sure thing, Officer Gomez. Well, it's been nice chatting with you. Thanks again for coming. Happy birthday, dearie. My goodness, I hope I didn't miss the party. They sure did. My, my. Ten years old already? Why, I can remember helping your dad change your diapers. And now look at you, a great big grown-up ten-year-old 
with your very own Pip Boy. Since this was such a special occasion, do you know what I did? I wrote you a poem just for you. I hope you like it. Of course, run along now, dearie, and have yourself a wonderful birthday. Enjoy the party, sir? Ha! I only showed up because Amata's friends with the brat. Give them a few more minutes, and then I want that place cleaned up and everybody back to work. Sure thing, sir. What are you doing down here, young man? I thought kids weren't allowed down on the reactor level. <laughs> you sure are. Pip boy and everything. Look at that. If you can wait just one more minute, I think your dad will want to give you the surprise himself. Are you ready for your surprise? The Overseer gave you your Pip-Boy, and you're old enough to do some work, so I figure you're old enough for this. Your own BB gun. It's a little old, but it should work perfectly. Jonas found it down here. It was in pretty rough shape. It took us a good three months to find the parts to get it working again. You know how tough it is to find a spring that small? Good thing Butch misplaced that switchblade of his. <laughs> so, what do you think? Want to give it a try? We sure can't, unless we want the Overseer beating down our door. Jonas and I have found a place, though. Come on. Well, what do you think? You can come down here and shoot any time you want. Couldn't have done it without Jonas's help. You make sure to thank him. Happy birthday, buddy. I hope you have fun with it. Maybe so. But you still better not let the Overseer see you carrying that around. That's a real gun, as far as he's concerned. Go on, Jonas shoot something hard for me. Present. The least you can do is be polite.
Good work. That's one less round roach to deal with. Let's get a picture together. Capture the moment. Hey, Jonas, get a picture of me with a big game hunter. Smile. Boys and girls have different parts. What is your problem anyway? So I'm the overseer's daughter, so what? That that like, I get any kind of special Tell treatment. Me. Revelation 21.6. I am Alpha and Omega. The beginning and the end. As far as I can tell, you're a perfectly healthy 16-year-old boy. So yes, you have to go to class to take your GOAT exam. Go on now.